Emergency officials in Lake and Sumter counties are also keeping a close eye on this storm. News 6 reporter Jerry Askin continues our team coverage now with how families and officials are getting ready. Jerry. Ginger, yes, and this sandbag location in Sorrento here in Lake County is slowing down for the day. In fact, we just saw someone here about 30 minutes ago come and get his sandbag here in Lake County. Here's what it's looking like here at this sports center in Lake County. Meantime, I've been in touch all day with Lake and Sumter County emergency officials who said they're keeping a close watch on Elsa. I'd be prepared, but I, I hope it's just a rainstorm. Right now, it's all eyes on Tropical Storm Elsa. And here in Lake County at Ace Hardware in Claremont. Yeah, pretty much propane's what we've been doing today. I ran into people buying propane tanks today, generators and water. Many saying they're prepping for any possible impacts from Elsa. Power, uh, batteries, flashlights. Again, I got my generator. No, I'm just, I gas okay. up my car and my oh, truck yeah. just to make sure my tanks are full, just to be prepared. This coming as Lake County emergency leaders told me they have shelters on standby to open if necessary. It could be an issue and I think our primary threat right now is going to be the rainfall and flash flooding. And while they're watching the storm's latest track, they're also offering sandbags at five locations, including here at this sports complex in Sorrento. Emergency leaders also want to encourage residents to be ready just in case. Make sure that they've got that uh, disaster supply kit, the food, the water, uh, that they need and uh, understanding their communications plan. Yeah, and right now, Lake County leaders are encouraging residents to sign up for its um, emergency notification system called Alert Lake. I place that information on our website right now at clickorlando.com. Meantime, nearby Sumter County officials told me they too are watching the latest track and are prepared to open shelters if necessary. We're live here in Lake County. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.